Hey there everyone, it's Jenna. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna show you some of my favorite holiday decor pieces. And while I haven't officially started decorating for the holidays just yet, I wanted to get this video out there so you can kind of see what I will be decorating with and just give you a chance to get some of these products before they sell out because every year they always sell out super quickly. So everything will be linked below in the description box through affiliate links. And I do try really hard to source products that are affordable, but still give off that high-end designer expensive feel. So there will be a couple splurges sprinkled throughout, but mostly everything is very affordable. And there will be some brand new products from this year, as well as like my tried and true staples that I use year after year. And I'll be giving you styling tips and examples for all of the products. So hopefully this video will be jam packed with holiday decorating inspiration for your own space this season. So I hope you all enjoy it. And without further ado, let's get into it. All right, so this first piece I'm really excited about, it's brand new from this year, and I feel like it's very affordable and creates a high impact for not a lot of money. And it is this stunning sketched winter landscape. This is from Kirkland's and this was $19.99. And I feel like it looks a lot more expensive than that. I love the vintage frame that it comes in and how it kind of has that old world feel to it. And something that I like to do when decorating to make things feel very calm and natural is bring the outdoors in. And this is a great way to do that is just from this very simple sketch. It feels like an artist just sat down in front of a forest and just sketched this out really quick. I love how you can see all the details and the lines in the sketching, making it feel like it has movement to it. It gives off a cozy vibe. And I just think this would look really pretty in any room, a bathroom, a kitchen. You could also pop this on a little easel or an art stand to make this more of a moment and a statement in a styling situation. So maybe you could do that on a console table or on a shelf. It's also a great size so it can fit on a countertop or if you want to just pop it on a shelf. So, so versatile and just a great price for $19.99. Okay, so I don't know if you all remember, but from our mantlescape last year, I just layered a bunch of different chunky knit cream stockings together to add a nice little cozy punch of texture. And I really liked the cream ones, but I found this one to add to the mix this year. It is this really pretty chocolate brown chunky knit stocking. This was only $14.99 at Target and it seems to be really great quality. The liner in here is really nice and the knit is super chunky and just really warm feeling, which I love. This year I'm trying to incorporate some more earthy browns into my color palette for the holidays. So I figured this would be perfect. I'm just gonna layer it in with the cream ones that I already have. So this is kind of like an example. And I believe this cream one is actually available right now online as well. I think it's like $12.99 and they also offer a two pack as well. So both of these are really great quality and I'm excited to layer the brown in this year for a little bit more of a punch of contrast. Okay, so this next piece I think is one of the most expensive looking pieces, but one of the most insanely cheap prices. And it's one of my all time favorites. I actually posted a reel about it last year and it went viral. It got over like a million views and people were obsessed with this so much that it sold out so quickly. So I'm very happy to see that it has been restocked this year. And I'm just gonna hold it for a second cause it's really big, but it is this super cute burlap four foot Christmas tree. This did come with some berries and I did remove those because I felt like I wanted a more natural look. And I know a lot of people do love decorating with red for the holidays, but for me, I wanted to keep my color palette really natural. And I love that without the red berries on it, it just looks like you went outside and chopped it down. It looks so realistic. And this guy is a four foot tree and it was only $39.99, which is a great deal. I'm gonna put it down because it's really heavy. But last year I just popped this on a little vintage stool that I had with a planter from Hobby Lobby and it really transformed our dining corner. It was so simple to do and so cheap, but I just loved that little styling moment and felt like it looked like something straight out of like a Pottery Barn or Ballard Designs magazine. So definitely a great value. Get it while you can. I remember it sold out very quickly last year. Okay, so this next piece is super affordable. It's so easy to layer into a space, but it instantly elevates your decor and makes it feel a lot more designer and polished and it is this super pretty burgundy ribbon and it has this frayed edge on here. Last year, I used this for everything. I just simply tied a bow around our utensil crock and it instantly elevated it. It made it feel a lot more festive for the holidays. I also just 
just tied a simple bow onto our stockings to add a little punch of color and contrast. I used this to tie some of our wreaths on the backs of our chairs. It really came in handy and especially when you repeat this throughout a space, it helps to solidify that color scheme and makes everything feel really put together and polished. But all you are doing is just literally tying bows onto everything. You can get a three pack on Amazon for $14.99, which I feel like is a really good deal. And then you just get to reuse it year after year. So definitely one of those little details that I feel like makes a really large impact. Okay, so this next piece, I bought it a little bit late in the season last year. So I think I only posted a photo of it to my like to know it and maybe on my Instagram. I really don't think I put it in any videos last year, but it is this super cute ceramic gingerbread cookie jar. It was a little bit of a splurge. It's from Pottery Barn, but I cannot tell you how many compliments I get on this thing and just how much joy I get from filling this with my Christmas toffee. It is always going to go out front and center on our kitchen countertop just because I feel like it makes such a statement and is so festive and cute, but it's just such minimal effort just to pop it out on the countertop. I usually put this in a little tray. You could also just pop this on a tablescape and it would be so cute and decorative but also practical as serveware if you are putting it out for dessert or whatever and you could just have guests take their cookies or toffee or treats or whatever out of here. I just think that it is so adorable and not only is it functional but is a great classic decor piece that will never go out of style. Okay so recently I went up to Blowing Rock, North Carolina and if you haven't heard of Blowing Rock it is this super cute little mountain town. It totally gives me Stars Hollow vibes from Gilmore Girls and it's so great to go there during the fall so I recently went up there with my sister and my husband and her fiance and I found this cute little store called the Brass Exchange and they have a lot of home decor and of course they had so many cute holiday decor pieces I told myself I didn't need anything but I did find these really cute pomegranates now when I saw these I got extra excited because they actually sell these same ones on McGee & Co which I actually don't think it's too bad for $20 you get both of them which for a designer style I feel like that's decent. It's not like cheap or anything, but I felt like it was acceptable. <laughs> but these are what I call a finishing piece. So they're perfect for accenting like a vase filled with holiday greenery and a candle and just kind of giving off that really elevated designer feel. For the holidays, I love to decorate with that aged brass look because it helps to add warmth to a space and just kind of make it feel a little bit more vintage and old world. So I like that these are like a natural seasonal fruit, but they have that antiqued brass finish, which I think is really pretty. Okay, so this next piece is my tried and true favorite greenery stem to decorate with for the holidays. And they are these really beautiful, real touch Norfolk pine stems. Now you've probably seen these all over the internet and the ones that are very popular are the ones from A Floral and those are $28 per stem but these guys were $9.99 each at Kirkland's and sometimes you can even use a coupon with them. That is a much better value and I've honestly used just two of these in a vase and it looks really beautiful and full. If you have a larger scale room or you have a super large vase, then I would maybe get like four to five of these. But if you have a small vase that you're just putting in somewhere like a bathroom or popping on a stool or something like that, you can even just get away with two. I love the movement that these have and how realistic they look and not only how realistic they look but how realistic they feel these are just so beautiful and look like you just collected them right from outside and i love that you can get them for a lot cheaper at kirkland's and they also have it in garland as well. So I did purchase several of these at Kirkland's. These are $39.99 and they are very similar to the A floral ones that cost $58. So especially if you're getting several of these, you can save quite a bit of money. And last year I used these on our mantle and it was so beautiful. I just draped some fairy lights throughout it and it just looked so magical. And I just love the lifelike look that these give off. And I will definitely be using them again on our mantle this year. So if you are looking to invest in a very realistic and lifelike faux greenery for the holidays, definitely consider this garland and then the stems because nothing tops them in my opinion. They just look so beautiful and elegant and expensive and realistic when in reality they aren't too bad. So 
Okay, so when it comes to the holidays, it's no secret that a big reason a lot of us love it so much is just that feeling of nostalgia that we get. So when decorating for the holidays, I love to incorporate pieces that have that old world, antique kind of vintage-y feel. Even if they aren't old, I just feel like incorporating pieces that look old help to give that cozy feel to a space. It feels very elevated, it adds texture. And I came across these really cute vintage inspired ornaments at the store in Blowing Rock at the brass exchange and if you look they have that really old world feel to them they have a lot of texture and kind of color variation and I just love anything like that what I'm actually going to use these for is not on our tree but I'm going to use these as bowl filler because like I said I like to decorate with that old brass look and I feel like these would really help to add a lot of warmth to a styling moment so I'm just gonna pop these in a little bowl and that's a tip that you can use for any ornaments really that you love or that tie in to your color scheme or what you're trying to go for just use some as bowl filler and it lends itself to a really elevated designer look and feel but all you did was just put some ornaments in a bowl all right so i just could not get enough of that real touch norfolk pine look so i went ahead and snagged this super cute mini tree this guy looks very lifelike super realistic but it was only 29.99 on amazon and i figured this would just be the perfect accent piece for really any space a bathroom a kitchen a centerpiece to a tablescape in a dining room you could put this on a console table even a coffee table and not only is it affordable but it looks so exciting expensive. Again, it just has that same real touch Norfolk pine look to it. And it just comes in this simple black pot, but something that you can do to it to make it feel even more elevated is just pop it in a little planter or a utensil crock or a vase that you already have. So maybe even a little garden pot that you aren't using from the spring or summer, you could just put this in there and that automatically is going to make it look super realistic and lifelike. And this is one of those pieces that is just so worth the money because it can literally go into any room and instantly make it feel festive and rustic and just feels like you're bringing the outdoors in and definitely an awesome deal at $29.99. Okay so this next thing you've probably also seen all over the internet but I just feel like it is so timeless and classic and they are these really cute bronze sculpted reindeer. Now these are available on Pottery Barn. The smallest size is $20 and then this size I believe is $40. There is an even larger size but I don't believe that is currently in stock but I will link it if it is. I lucked out and I was able to find a dupe at Aldi last year and I got all three reindeer for $40 which was a really good deal. So these are actually from Aldi. These are not the Pottery Barn ones but they look almost identical. So I just think that these are a really beautiful styling piece to pop on something like a console table, maybe a little bar area or a shelf. I had them styled on our mantle for a little bit last year and then I moved them to our upstairs game room because I thought they would look really cute on our little serving area just as an accent piece to help add some movement and lifelike quality to that area. So if you struggle with holiday styling, I feel like these are a really great solution because you can just place the two of these together and it instantly dresses up any space, any area. If you just put it with a vase with some holiday greenery, that just completes a little grouping right there and is super easy to do and looks really festive. Okay, so a close second to the Norfolk Pine Garland is this really beautiful cedar garland. Now, I actually found this at the store in Blowing Rock. It was only $32 per thing of garland, which I thought was such a good deal, which is why I bought it. And I did price comparisons online, and the cheapest I was able to find it for was $60 on Amazon, and I believe it's the same one. But if you guys can see, this is just really good quality. Like, the movement looks so real. Each little branch has a lot of detail, and it just has that light lifelike quality to it and what I really liked about this was that it was perfect for draping so I don't know if you can see but if you just kind of like drape it over something like a console table or a shelf or a canopy bed or a mantle it just looks really natural and kind of flows and has a pretty shape so that's why I bought it I bought two of them again I got it for a steal at the blowing rock store but I will try to link the similar one below okay so come holiday time obviously everyone needs a cozy throw it's nice to have have a cozy throw for yourself as well as something that you can give as a gift so sometimes I'll just buy doubles just in case I need a last-minute gift but how cute is this knitted bobble knit throw 
I am so obsessed with anything with a good texture that has an organic natural color palette like this earthy brown. This was from Target. It was only $35 and it actually looks very similar to one they had sold at Pottery Barn in years past. I haven't seen that one in a while, but still you can get that expensive designer look for a really great price. It also is very warm. You know, sometimes when you have a knitted throw, the air just kind of moves through it and it doesn't feel that cozy and it's more decoration. This one actually does provide some warmth and I feel like it is really soft. So this is definitely a great way to add texture to your space. I'm just gonna throw it on our white reading chair to help add some contrast and warmth. So I love leaning into those warm earthy tones come winter time because it really helps to cozy the space up and this will tie in great with our chocolate brown stocking as well. So definitely a great piece to have around for the fall season as well as the holidays. All right, everyone, that about wraps up this video. I hope you enjoyed this holiday home decor haul. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. It really does help to support the channel and be sure you're subscribed because there is a lot more holiday content coming your way. And if I find any other holiday decor deals, I will be posting them on my like to know it. I also try to alert you all in my Instagram stories as well. So be sure you're following me over there so you don't miss anything else and I just want to thank you all so much for watching this video. I hope you have a fabulous week and I will see you in my next one. Bye!